I don't know if this is going to be audio only. This will probably end up being a meme. Um, I, I, this is a serious video though. Um, this is this is not a meme, but it will end up being a meme. I don't know. I don't want to get off topic about that. But I'm 27. Believe it or not. That was a pretty. That's pretty good deep voice. Um, but I just want to get a stupid video. This this video is so fucking stupid, and I know I should be ranting about bigger problems in life but it's it's shit like this that gives me identity crisis it gives me an identity crisis i have a history of being a femboy and i'm mostly like now like um um i do have to keep my voice down because i still live with my parents though but um i am like natural like um no what, what the fuck am i trying to say Nowadays, I'm, like, androgynous. Nowadays, I'm kind of, like, sometimes, like, kind of, like, masculine. Well, like, I'm masculine in dressing. Or, like, I dress normal or whatever. Um, physically, I'm not masculine, but I dress normal, whatever, 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 right? But sometimes I like to dress feminine. There's this stupid meme about programmer socks and, like... This is, I know people be like, bruh, it's a meme, bruh, it's a meme. See, here's the thing, though. He, here's, here's why I can't brush this meme off. Um, again, I don't know if this is going to be audio only. I don't know if this is going to be visual, but if, if it's visual, you'll see I have a little bit of facial hair growing because I don't look totally feminine, but whatever. But, sorry to get off topic, but... The reason why I can't fucking brush off this meme is the problem is there's a lot of people in the comments, like there's a lot of people like replying to this meme by saying, yeah, it's a stereotype, yeah, it's a myth, but it's kind of true. And I get a bunch of people saying, as someone that's studying computer science, I am a femboy, or as someone that started off a femboy, like it's either, it's either, it's, it's either. It's either these people were femboys in the beginning and they're learning to become a computer programmer or they were a computer programmer and now they want to be a femboy or I don't know, I don't know, it doesn't even fucking matter, right? There's a bunch of people in the reply sections of, 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 this, of this meme by confirming that, you know, this meme, even though it's supposed to be a joke, it's kind of true. And I'm pissed off because I'm somewhat of a femboy androgynous something. But I don't know how to program shit. Am I the only one that doesn't know how to code? I'm having an identity crisis. I wish this was like Capo Cab and fake joke video. I wish this was, but this is seriously, I'm sick of not fitting in. You know? People could be like, well, look at goths. There's stereotypes about goths being devil worshippers. Yeah, but the problem with that is a lot of goths dismiss that stereotype. While as with this femboy programmer shit, a lot of them are kind of like leaning to like, yeah, it's kind of true. I hate to bring this up, but it's kind of like autism in a sense because... It's a stereotype that autistic people are good at like computers but a lot of them a lot of autistic people actually reinforce that stereotype by saying well it's kind of true i mean i think there's actually studies about that i think that autistic people are good at computers you look up you look up what what are some good jobs for autistic people and then you get all the it shit right so it's kind of not really a stereotype I mean, autistic people being good at math as a stereotype, like, that is not really well accepted. But this whole autism computer thing, it's not really a stereotype anymore. There's a vast majority of them that are good at computers. Same thing, same exact thing with this femboy shit, right? I know this is gonna get memed on, it's gonna attract a lot of trolls. I don't know what the fuck is wrong with me. I never really got an official answer. 
I was thinking maybe I had an intellectual disability because I don't understand certain concepts. I've never been good at puzzles, even when they did those tests for you in school to figure out the puzzles and matching them. I'm not good at that. I'm not good at math. I'm not good at computers in general. I, it's, 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 it's just, it pisses me off. And I'm kind of glad that I don't dress feminine anymore because if I did, I would have to deal with a lot of this stupid bullshit of these stupid, like the stupid memes and shit, you know? I do want to end this video though, but this is a serious video. This is coming from, I don't know what I am. I don't know if I have a learning disability. Maybe I don't have a disability at all. Maybe I'm just a neurotypical that doesn't know how to code. But I'm just so fucking sick of trying to fit in a community and either I don't fit in the community or I do but those stupid stereotypes, I'm just so fucking sick of it. I can't fucking code. I can't fucking program. I just, most crash dressers probably don't even know how to program. Like what does crash dressing have to do with programming? That's so fucking irrelevantly stupid. I don't know. This is my rant. And like I said, I don't know what the hell is wrong with me mentally. I've been to many psychiatrists, can't get an accurate diagnosis of anything. But like I said, I've been to many psychiatrists, I can't get in, I can't like get like a diagnosis of anything. But obviously there's something fucking wrong with me because I can't fucking understand numbers, anything. I can't understand shit like that, right? I use the, the, I use the computer basic, like I use the basics of the computer, you know? I don't know that 3.14 ABC bullshit, you know? I don't know.